What are the main characteristics of good technical writing? There are many, of course, but one can look at seven basic uh, features that characterize good technical writing. The first feature, of course, is technical writing should be correct. It could be anything else, but if it's not correct, it's not good technical writing. For example, here I have an example for you. Water boils at 100 degrees centigrade is a correct statement, but water boils at 200 degrees centigrade is obviously not correct. Therefore, it has no place in technical writing. The second rule, technical writing should not only be correct, but precise as well. For example, when warmed up, a pot of water eventually starts to boil is correct, but it's not precise. Therefore, it's not good technical writing. Whereas, when warmed up, a pot of water starts to boil at 100 degrees centigrade is not only correct, but it's precise as well. Technical writing should be relevant. If you are writing a user's manual for power boats, why should you talk about history of physics? Don't get distracted. Only include what is relevant in a technical document. This brings us to another feature to be log logically consistent. For example, start the car and insert the ignition key is not logically consistent because first you insert the key and then start the car. So you should watch the sequence in which directions are given, steps are written in a technical document. Good technical writing should be brief. To tell the truth, you should ideally not be opening valve A before you shut down valve B. It's just too wordy. How about never open valve A before you shut down valve B? Simple and easy and correct. That's the way you should write it. Technical writing should be unemotional. For example, ignore any stupid error messages from the database server. I just made up that sentence, but to drive home the message that the correct way to say it is ignore any error messages from the database server. There is no need to qualify to describe an error message as stupid. It's an overkill. And here is a thousand dollar word. Technical writing should be non-anthropomorphic. Anthropomorphic. That is, we should not project human attributes and human qualities to non-human systems. For example, the client machine loves thin, ap thin applications is not good technical writing because love is not an emotion that a machine can feel. A better way to write it is a client machine works more efficiently with thin applications. So these are some of the features that any good technical document should have. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching.